think about being that dude who's got like an Instagram model girlfriend, having that public. That what she be thinking. She, she wants thinking. that. No, she all she think about. You want one of Instagram model girl? I'm like, bro, you stop saying that, bro. That shit ain't cool. You it don't ain't want like that? it ain't possible, bro. If I would, come on, bro. If I mm. want that, then you don't think I could do it? Right. You're not ready for it, though. I mean, I don't know. I be looking at it. I, I be looking at everybody who got them, get them a, a rap girlfriend, and both of them popular, and they go up. And mm. I respect that. I don't think I don't respect it. I just don't think this is my character, and I don't like being fake. Mm. So, even if everybody say to you right now, Adam, go kill this person. Go kill him. I'm down. If you see what I'm saying, like if it ain't in your heart, shit is being fake. Even if you do go kill him, mm. it's not being real to kill him. You being right. fake. Do you feel like killing? Do you want to kill him? I don't know who it is, but yes, I'm down. That's all. I'm a I'm soldier, saying. man. I'm a. You put the battery in my back. I'm gone. That's all I'm saying. <sighs> but nah, bodies shit, everywhere. So. You right though. It's gonna look like Iraq out right, here, bro. Right, like, I'm down. That's that's what a nigga's supposed to say <laughs> when they got them totally retarded for sure. <laughs> but were you ever that dude? Who was just ready to go? On, always on been, a, always been a bo boss, and, mm. and always been ready to go. But like I said, on command is gonna be a different. It's gonna be when you link up with somebody who you really love, and you know they don't do nothing but what they gotta do. So every time he call you, you know it's that time. It ain't like I do this for a living, and you go, you over there kicking it, and I call you. Nah, mm. if you call me, somebody been fucking with you. Hell yeah, I'm dropping everything on command. Don't care who it is or where you at or what we got to do. You know what I'm saying? There's only a certain number and of people I always, you have that I kind no of relationship. Ever, I've always been that nigga. You can add anybody right now. That's my problem. I still think I'm regular and everybody don't think I'm a star. You know what I'm saying? Right. So, yeah, that kind of uh, brings us to part of the DMZ conversation or before. When I heard the story of how you fell out with uh, Goo and Dude, that basically was how it was told to me is Pablo tried to basically mediate a situation <clears throat> yeah. and tried to squash some shit and it didn't work out. Yeah, what happened was, I'm going to tell you the whole story. Y'all want to know. Okay, boom. Okay. With me in DC, DC and DMV, the whole town loved me. You see what I'm saying? Even the people who act like they fuck Pablo, this and that. At one point, y'all was some Pablo fan asking for a feature. Mm -hmm. You see what I'm saying? Facts. So even the f people on your team, I know them. I know people personally. Like The people y'all talking about, I know one of them personally from the streets. And mm -hmm. you coming to get shit and meeting... We actually know each other. When I came to DC, not my first time, but like my second time, we rolled up here like two, three sprinter vans. The your manager, you know what I'm saying? I don't even speak names, but the manager, the person you whoop the whoop, who was actually there, used to gave me goddamn business while I was in DC. Gave me a free pint of lean, goddamn he'll blow, make sure you scrape right here. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? So I be really knowing niggas. Fuck out of what a nigga think. So, boom. When they came to D.C., the whole D.C. loved me. But when I tried to sign the artists, you know I was signing the artists, putting niggas on. Can't mm -hmm. nobody ever put me on. Like, I was told from me to me, from the niggas who I know, who really in the street, they were like, blow, you know everybody love you. He was like, only thing happened was when you signed or, or gravitated toward them, it made certain people who know they're not right or hate them or don't like them, they couldn't fuck with you no more. All of a sudden, so you instead of having the, the beach, whole yeah. streets, now you got half of them, you got half mm. niggas who looking at you like, why you fucking with them niggas? Which me personally, I never knew. Mm. I, I never knew y'all was internet beefing with people because it wasn't no real beef to me. So if you going back and forth on a nigga on the internet saying, fuck you, oh, I'm going to catch you, I'm going to kill you, I didn't even know this. Mm. You see what I'm saying? So when I'm shopping and shit, nigga run up and catch you for that shit you were doing. But I didn't even know it. I'm, when I'm walking up, I got bags in my hand from Rodeo, Dior store. I'm like, what the hell is going on? Woo, woo, woo. A nigga called my name, like, nah, bro. You know what I'm saying? They know me. Nah, bro. They're between me and bro. Even then, I'm not that type of nigga. Like I just told you, are you ready to I'm always ready. Uh -huh. But it didn't escalate to that yet. So I'm walking toward it to get it ready. Like, hold on. I don't give a damn what's going on. They about three, four of y'all. Y'all look like y'all corner and little bro. You see what I'm saying? So before I can even do that, I'm trying to talk to the nigga I do know, and some niggas hit me from behind. Oof. See what I'm saying? Which happens, bro. I ain't gonna lie, I done been in so many fights, a real resume from the streets. I done hit niggas with bricks, chairs, and put in the concrete while you on the ground. I done did dirty shit, so I took my lick and kept it moving. Mm. That's why I went up, like, I'm all right. You see what I'm saying? Because I done been through a lot of shit, so 
you can't when you go through shit, you can't always expect to be on the good end of the stick. Right. So I took it like shit. I done did shit before. I done hit niggas. I done I know that's how I fight. I hit first. So I know I done hit niggas without you being ready to get hit. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? But it actually was from behind. I ain't even see it. But do you think was that an example of you basically like trying to be the big homie in the situation, trying to squash it in a situation nah. where if you had known the full situation, you wouldn't have even tried to get involved? If I would have known the full situation, I might not even dealt with the people I mm. deal with because everybody I deal with, genuine. If you say you're a killer, you really shooting at niggas. If you say you're a goddamn dealer, you really dealing. Mm -hmm. You might kill a nigga if you got to. That's just part of the game. You see what I'm saying? But I, don't, I never dealt with that ever. I, I'm, that's new to me. You know me, Adam. We want, we couldn't even talk about no shit like this. The first podcast, like clout or right. who internet. I don't know about no fucking internet beef. So I got caught up in it. Even when, okay, boom, y'all snuck me. I got on big shit. I'm a re I'm regular still though. Even though I got on big shit, I don't. I ain't took none of none. I'm just walking up like this. Uh -huh. Okay, two of them hit the ground. I still had two on. Still had a watch on. Still had thirty thousand in my pocket. As soon as them motherfuckers hit the ground. Niggas picked them up and started doing this, mm. running. So when I get up and I'm ready to get in there, all I see is running. That's all I see as soon as I get up. Right. You know what I'm saying? So somebody hit you and then somebody know. else grabbed the chain off the ground? and yeah, Somebody mm. hit me. When they hit me, I stumbled. Uh, get back up. I done been hit before. I ain't tripping. I, I, they caught me, though, because from behind. And I think I got hit twice. I don't know. But all I know is I got back up. When I got back up and was trying to get in there, it was nobody to get in there with. All you seen was... Right. Okay, boom. When that happened right there, I'm like, I look at the shit. I still got on the chain. Still got my watch on looking. I'm like, what the fuck? I don't know at first. I forget I got jury. I ain't never had shit. Mm. They look, and I do that right here, Adam. I say, damn, my shit fell. After that, I ain't like, I'm not used to internet. I'm not used to all that. That's real life. I was fucking with my little partner. I got snuck. My shit fell. It's simple. So when the world be, oh, you this, you that. Man, listen, man. My resume is so long, and I'd be a snitch on myself to put my resume on the internet. You see what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So I'm not going to go back and forth about that. I ain't tripping. But so did that immediately end your relationship with Goon Dude? That like, Did you not appreciate how they behaved in nah, that scenario it, what, after it happened? Or? What, what it was is not immediately. I was trying to see what was going on after it happened, and then that's what I investigated. Mm. I said, why do you niggas jump me? What they got going on? And that's what I was told. Hey, these niggas who you with? been going back and forth on the net with niggas and niggas has actually been trying to catch him, which I respect and realize, not trying to be funny or nothing. I don't have nothing against Goon or uh, what's the name, but I'm saying that's what it was. Like you were saying, fuck you, I'm gonna kill you, or I'm gonna slap your girl or your mm -hmm. mama or whatever, and the nigga was waiting to catch you, you see what I'm saying? Right. But I'm, that's not my style, Adam. Just to be real, that ain't my style. Even right now, if a nigga did that, I'd be the nigga that's trying to catch you before I'd be the nigga that's saying it, you see what I'm saying? Mm. So that's kind of a weird position for you to be in where you consider yourself to be a certain kind of dude, but then all of a sudden you got crazy Twitter shit going on and mm -hmm. memes mm -hmm. and all kinds of shit, and you feel like you got to respond to that, you got to jump into that. I mean, shit, it's, it's, it's life. You always through a new a new obstacle, you know what I'm saying? And I had to, I had to realize that because me, I'm thinking I'm, I'm real. I know I'm real. I ain't even think. I know I'm real. I done been in the street my whole life, but this a new angle of it. You got niggas who got three followers who ain't never did shit who can say something. You see mm -hmm. what I'm saying? And you got, it's just a different game. Ain't no, when it comes to that shit, though, the internet ain't got no loyalty. That's me. I'm loyal. The internet ain't got no. So it's certain sh characters that bought that shit that niggas are really pull their pants down to get on the internet. That's not me. I ain't mm -hmm. no pull my pants down. <clears throat> I go on ahead and just work and hustle. That's what I do. I ain't trying to change who I am for the internet. I like being me, you see what I'm saying? Right. Can you see Q to Fool and keep it moving, or is there still, like, tension there? I ain't going to answer that question, Adam. You know what the <laughs> fuck going on with me. <laughs> I ain't nowhere near no hoe. That's on my mama. That's on Allah. For real. And I don't even, I, that's not even acting like I'm a bully, or I can't catch my lick because this, this shit how we do in the streets, Shit, you can be the nigga who got them killed or get killed, and both of them bad. You see what I'm saying? So the best thing that you do is stay out of them and try to avoid at all costs, if you add me. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Some shit you can't avoid. You just got to gotta handle your business. And then when you talk about that, that's a nigga who's talking. It's real street shit going on with niggas I knew that was up there. Well, shit already done happened. You see what I'm saying? Well, 
You talking about a nigga who just running his mouth? Fuck all that. But you right? No, and no, the answer is no. <laughs> so it's it's kind of weird because there's all this shit going on behind the scenes, and then like you end up being sort of the poster boy for mm -hmm. whoever you're around, and vice versa. Like he's the famous one out of the crew. Yeah, I, I mean I understand though. It's all about understanding, bro. Like. Yeah, I done been in the street to the point where you'll take a loss, you'll grind from a nickel bag all the way to a zip, all the way to get you a pound and then lose the whole pound. Mm. See what I'm saying? It's just, what you gonna do now? Are you gonna go do it again better? Are you gonna give up, quit? What are you doing? You throwing in the rag, you finna go get you a job now? What you finna do? Right. See what I'm saying? So it be challenging too, so, cause everybody ain't perfect. Right. See what I'm saying? So some nigga got them, do what they do. I just know me. I'm right. strong man. I had to realize you can't listen to nobody, nobody's opinion. You can't tell a nigga how you is. You let a nigga tell you you fake? Right, come on, man. I'm probably the really thing out here. Y'all niggas, I ain't even tripping on. No.